Hey guys, how's it going? Crew my Sanctuary and welcome back to another episode of Who to Sign For. Well, who, who are we doing today? As you can tell by the title, it is Leighton Orient of League 2. They did just get relegated. Obviously, we're going into FIFA 17 now. It'll be their second season in uh, the bottom tier of English football. But we're going to say who they can sign to hopefully get them back up to where they should be. Maybe Championship kind of standard team. That's kind of where I see Leighton Orient at. I'm going to recommend four, four or five players for them. We're going to show you their budget, their star man, all the stuff that we usually do, and where the board thinks that they should be. I think automatic promotion for Leighton Orient. Leighton Orient don't have as much money as uh, most teams in the league. I think they're near about 700,000. Whereas Portsmouth, the last team I did, did have about 1.1 million. So it is a little bit of a step down for a team like Leighton Orient. But you should still be able to do it because League 2 is quite a competitive league. But you should be okay if you sign the players that I do recommend for this. And you should be alright uh, during uh, your career mode. Again, if you have anyone that uh, have any teams that you think I should do, please leave them in the comment section below. Someone's already recommended Fulham, so we'll be doing Fulham after I've done one more team in the, in, uh, in the bottom two of English Football League 2. Uh, next, after that team, I'll go on to recommendation. I have one recommendation so far, Fulham. Again, put it in the comment section below. So you can recommend teams to me and I'll do them for you. So here we go uh, into the um, into the late Orient career mode. Remember you can again do pre-season tournaments. You can get you extra money with the pre-season tournament money if you win it. And the starting budget money you should have enough to progress and sign all the players that I recommend. We're looking at goalkeepers really for Leighton Orient. Uh, a right back, a uh, striker. That kind of area, only because uh, Leighton Orient don't really have that strong of a team. I think they have one or two players that you maybe want to keep. But we're going to go have a look at the transfer uh, budget here. Yeah, it's 725000 You can do a bit with that, but you can't really do a lot, like make a game-changing sign-in. You can go up to about 900000 in your transfer budget, and you can go up to, I think it's about 20, nearly 20000 Yeah, 18900 in your wage budget. So okay, let's go jump into our shortlist and see the five recommended players. First, we have Garrel Karai. As everyone knows him, the jogging bottom guy from the Euros. He is a free transfer, so you can get him. You can get him relatively cheap to play for his wages. I think he's about seven thousand on his wages, so you can get him for free. He is a good signing. You can keep him for a season at seventy-nine rated, and then he stays there. Sign him on a two-year contract, and he'll be there for for a good season. Again, we do have Chris Kirkland, another old goalkeeper. But they are good because old goalkeepers are cheap and goalkeepers do tend to peak at uh, a later age. Right back wise we have Kieran Freeman from Sheffield United. He's got good potential he goes up to about 71 rated so that's quite good potential. Only 450,000 you should probably snap him up on cheap. Next person we have another Sheffield United player and it's Mark McNulty. As you can see he's only 60 overall but he can go up to I think 70, 75 rated which is very good for a young striker valued at 220,000. And finally we have David Mooney, uh, 66 rated, uh, 30 year old striker. Again he is quite old, I've gone for quite old for late and orient players here. But once you get the old players in all you need to do is get out of League 1 and get out, of, and then, then get out of League 2. And then you should be okay. And then from the championship onwards, you should be able to get that that high 70 rep of players. Those are the players that you should probably start off with. Now we're looking at uh, Leighton Orient star man that you have to keep. It's definitely Dean Cox. I was going to look at Jay Simpson, but I thought Dean Cox was definitely the star man. He is the highest rated player at, at the club. So you probably would say he is the best player to keep hold of. So I would say make sure you don't sell Dean Cox for any price at all. He'd be someone I'd be definitely looking at keeping. And finally guys, we're going to show you um, what the board expects. They expect you to gain automatic promotion. So if you enjoyed the video, by all means leave a like. Uh, subscribe if you are new. And remember to suggest it in the comment section below. So see you guys soon. Peace.